So the Japanese name is Jinrui wa Suitai Shimashita. Uh, is it available on Crunchyroll? My question. It probably is if you look right. for Humanity Has Declined. And of course, uh, DevDrop brings up the the next thing that I was going to mention because we're talking now we're talking about like kind of melancholy, bittersweet uh, manga. Um, Yokohama Shopping Trip or Yokohama Kaidashi Kiko is a very long manga, uh, and there's also some OVAs and stuff that were made of it. Um, I can't remember if they made a TV show or not, but it's it's about Again, post-apocalyptic kind of feel. We don't know if an actual apocalypse has happened. But we do know that, uh, boy, has Japan flooded. Oh. And there, there are areas uh, of Japan that are now essentially underwater. And this is like, you got to picture, like, this is probably like about another 50 to 80 years maybe after that because a lot of infrastructure has declined. It's great music for this. <laughs> this is, a lot of infrastructure has kind of declined. This is just the story of Alpha, who uh, she is an android, and she runs Cafe Alpha. And she has a little scooter, and she goes to work every day, and she has this little cafe she runs, and she's always kind of waiting for someone to come visit her, somebody she's waiting for. I don't think we ever find out exactly who it is, because I don't remember. And there's a few people living around the area, and it's her interactions with them, it's her interactions of her, like, just the things that she does in her life, waiting for things to occur. Um, and it's just kind of a nice, sweet, quiet series. The same author who did that uh, does a manga called Position, which is really good. Uh, and uh, Kotanaba Drive, which is also really good. Yeah, okay, Alpha waits for her owner to show up. Um, Kotanaba Drive is another kind of nice... Uh, like sweet feeling manga about uh, these brief times in your life when when you can see between the lines of reality and you can see the things that are happening beyond it, um, and they're not they're not terrifying. They're just moments of unreality, which are very interesting. And the manga has a lot of fun drawing this very meditative feeling uh, moments. Uh, and my favorite of, of all the ones that, I forget the name of the mangaka, has done is um, Isaki no Kabu, or Isaki's Cub, or sorry, Cub. Yeah, Isaki no Kabu, because it's Isaki's Cub. It's, it's about, um, uh, it's about uh, a young man who has been, who has lent a uh, Piper Cub, I think it is? And because he wants to learn how to fly, and so there's this, this woman who uh, lives near him, and he learns how to fly from her, and he flies around in this cub to go, like, this Piper Cub, to go get uh, mail and to, like, uh, do little, like, errands and stuff like that, mostly because he just likes flying. And it's a very, like, if you want to see how to draw the wind, this is, it's a super cub, okay. Uh, you want to see how to draw the wind, um, the mangaka is very, uh, Ashina no Hitoshi. Uh, I believe is I've seen that show up in chat. Uh, it's it's just kind of amazing to to read these and get the sense of the feel and get the sense of the of the space in the area. So I'm being told that it's a super cub because he flies from the front seat, and in a regular cub you must fly from the rear seat because passengers sit in the front. That sounds amazing. <laughs> so anyway, uh, those are all really cool things to to check out. I think uh, they're great manga. Uh, not all of them have been turned into anime yet, but yeah, Humanity Has Declined is also, as I'm led to believe, an amazing anime. Hmm.